Welcome back everyone and welcome to my channel. Today a very weird and unusual video about my probably very last video I'll make. Uh, World of Worships video. Yes. Um, I kind of uh, lost the um, fun playing this game and also have some issue with my uh, wife uh, me staying too much on the internet and the computer overall and playing games you know um, however I still still do enjoy um, probably make some video about the um, vlogs about uh, fishing and other stuff that I'm I will share with you guys I do have very interesting videos in the near future so that I will definitely keep so what I'm trying to say yes I will keep my uh, YouTube channel but probably not make so much world of worship video anymore you know that's that's the gimmick uh, guys it's it's like eating the same food all over again uh, too many times probably uh, you don't think that it's such a awesome like very first time it's same story with the games um, overall I do like to play sometimes just to chill off and just to you know do some probably daily mission or whatever what I'm trying to say is that I may play this game but not as frequent as uh, I used to and um, yes today I will also show you probably one uh, of my favorite or probably one of the, the last ship that I would very much like to grind uh, I do have a um, quite significant uh, I do believe close to 300 ships or something um, and this is uh, literally this one I'll show you my very last tier 10 ship Petro Pavlovsk so yeah it is a good ship however I still honestly believe that it's not very fun to play I explain you why you see you with this ship it's one of the most broken and see how small it is it's pretty damn small and tanky as all hell so that is the gimmick about this uh, ship it's very small target and has all tools in the world to do a very good job of being a cruiser so being a cruiser it's definitely one of the most tankiest cruiser however it lacks in dpm it lacks in he and that's it because all other stats it's absolutely a monster ap are the best in the game aa is the best in the game and radars also get the best in the game of course turning radius it's another issue but what i'm trying to say guys it's that uh, I have no idea probably I will make a very last uh, video about what is my favorite uh, nation yes nation to play and also why let me know in a comment below what you think shall I do that uh, maybe f most for the new players who probably be just uh, research this uh, and game and have one good question which nation should I go for and uh, which line you know what I mean uh, I mean there are uh, 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 you know uh, light cruisers lines and of course there are uh, battle cruiser line and of course there are heavy cruisers so they are kind of playing differently uh, overall I still honestly believe that uh, the Soviet cruiser are pretty damn strong and uh, probably not the best the most uh, damage you can do and output it's probably some German and same story with the battleship but however let me know in comment below there is one tier 10 battleship that I did not research yet and uh, I still honestly believe it's pretty damn fun ship I'm not saying it's too strong but it's a very fun ship to play and I find um, shall I say quite good balance um yeah i will explain you which one i think not burgund it's it's a premium my first uh, research ship battleship it's fun but i still believe the touch tree the republic it's the one i i very much like to grind and that it's my very last grind um 
they do fulfill the role of a battleship. I mean, don't don't get me wrong. The armor, what armor? It's kind of a mediocre and so on. But in other stats, I still believe um, the French uh, battleship line are pretty damn amazing. And almost each and every tier, from tier six all the way to tier ten, they are absolutely um, some a uh, keeper. Yes, you heard me right. Even the tier eight which I find uh, very, uh, shall I say, uh, very interesting. I know it's not the best tier 8 battleship, but definitely one hell of a good guns for its tier. And of course, Alsace and Republic. So uh, I do have the Alsace, yes I do, but I did not play her enough with uh, time to unlock the, the the Republic, but I can do it in instantly. I can unlock the Republic right now. Uh, it's because I have 5.6 million free experience and 335 million credits. Uh, it's 300, yes, it is 335 million credits. So I do honestly believe I can unlock uh, Republic and Schlieffens, which I highly recommend you to grind that particular line, the battle German battle cruiser line. So, guys, there you have it. Uh, sure, guys, a series the life goes on, and while it used to be pretty fun game, it still is, but I kind of uh, lost the taste. I, I have kind of a weird to explain what I'm trying to say. Um, and the spring it's coming and there are of course other issues in this world without saying but if i let's say if i put in this way if i say a can you understand b um it's about what happened in this world and the connection between a and b and that is if you're really really smart uh, subscriber I, I do believe you think what I'm trying to say so for for all those reasons but main reason is kind, kind of a lost the, the the flavor it for, for me you know um, guys seriously there's nothing wrong with this game it's just me me I'm probably going uh, forward with my life and with my everything but very much looking forward to talk to you and share with you my experience and my life and my vlogs and my oh man I do have quite significant videos to come in the very very near future so stay tuned for more thanks guys and always captains versus and stay tuned for more